Welcome back to the Forex Lounge Fundamental Extras. Today is Tuesday, May 18th, 2010. Welcome back, one and all. Great that you could join us. Bloomberg.com today reports German investor confidence plunged in May as Europe's deepening debt crisis stoked concern about the euro's future and rattled financial markets. The Zoo Center for European Economic Research said its index of investor and analyst expectations dropped to 45.8 from 53 in April. The biggest decline since the collapse of Lehman Brothers. Economists expected a slide to 47 according to the median of 35 forecasts in the Bloomberg News survey. The index aims to predict development six months ahead. Getting to the charts, we see the blue line is the zoo investor confidence again dropping down to a level of 45.8. The previous month was a level of 53 in April and this cross is just below the 12 month moving average which is significant because when we're above the 12 month moving average it shows an improvement in the investor confidence. When we are below, it shows uh, an expectation of a falling economy. Now, compare the zoo, which is the violet line in this case, to the euro-dollar currency pair. Now, of course, the euro-dollar involves two currencies within a pair. However, nevertheless, during prosperous times when the zoo tends to rise, the euro-dollar tends to rise as well. During times when, econ when the economy falls in the eurozone, the zoo falls, the euro-dollar falls as well. So, we've seen the euro fall a lot virtually against all currencies. We've seen the zoo start to fall as well. If we see the zoo start to rise, we certainly may expect the euro dollar to rally over the long term. We can also compare the zoo, that's the light baby blue line, falling again to a level of 45.8 against the Kakaron, that's the green line, and the DAX, the equity market in Germany, the CAC is in France, the green line, uh, the DAX, which is the blue line in Germany. Now, there is a definite correlation during prosperous times when the zoo tends to rise, equity markets in the eurozone tend to rise. When the zoo falls, equity markets tend to fall as well. Lately, we've seen the equity markets start to turn to the downside, the zoo also turning back to the downside as well. So, we're seeing, to sum up, a decline in the zoo from to 45.8 from the previous month of 53. We would expect, if this trend continues to the downside, we would expect European equity markets and the euro against many other currencies to decline as well. We hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, email us anytime. Info at ForexLounge.com. We thank you for joining us. We wish you a great day. All profitable trades. And we look forward to seeing you back soon. Back inside the Forex Lounge.